between the two-year-old Phillies A and B divisions in Atlantic Sire Stakes action. The Trotters in race number seven. They're lining up behind the Nuna Petroleum starting gate. Let's go back upstairs to track announcer Vance Cameron. Wimrow Gem, Wedgwood, Summit City Nate, Supreme Monarch, Windermere, don't you worry. The field of five Trotters up on the gate, top of the stretch. They're approaching a start. Summit City Nate was off stride at the start, and off stride was the one Wimrode Gem, and there they go. Off and trotting, Wedgwood for the lead, Supreme Monarch up between horses, and Windermere. Don't you worry as they round the turn. Summit City Nate will arrive fourth, and then the trailer, that's Wimrode Gem. So to the back stretch for the first time. On the front end, Supreme Monarch the leader. Windermere, don't you worry, is coming early now. From the outside, third is Summit. Summit City Nate, then racing from fourth, that's Wedgwood, and the trailer is Wimrode Gems for the opening quarter mile. They were there in 29 and four. Windermere, don't you worry, has made the lead. Second now at the rail, Supreme Monarch. Summit City Nate on the outside, third. Wedgwood at the rail, fourth, and then in the backfield, Wimrode Gem the trailer. On route to the opening half mile, and it's all Windermere, don't you worry for Brody McPhee. Halfway home by four. Supreme Monarch is second. Racing third. Summit City Nate. Wedgwood is fourth. And Wimrode Gem fifth. Fifty-eight and two. The opening half mile are sitting up here. By the five-eighths they go. The leader, Windermere, don't you worry. Supreme Monarch is second. Summit City Nate third. Well back fourth is Wedgwood. On the outside, the trailer. Wimrode Gem, the three quarters next. Windermere, don't you worry, is clearly the leader. Supreme Monarch in at the rail second. Three quarters up in one. 28 and 4 good clip and they're down to an eighth of a mile left to trot Windermere don't you worry in total command second Supreme Monarch is on the run turning for home they're in deep stretch and Windermere don't you worry will win for Brody McPhee the stable mate Summit City Nate is second Wedgwood is rallied to be third one 59 flat. Well, that was an eventful one as we're going to see the replay here for race number seven. We had a couple of breakers, including the favorite, Wimro Gem, went on, run, on the run at the start. And then self destructing in the two hole there was Supreme Monarch in the stretch. Wundemir, don't you worry, went right to the front here going to the quarter. 29 and 4, 58 and 2, 128 and 4, 159 flat. Congratulations to owner Eric Johnson of Summerside, long time owner trainer he was a driver he was an announcer everything you can think of eric johnson former president of the prince county horseman's club his stable mates are one and two in this one for trainer norris rogers congratulations to him and the driver brody mcphee tonight summit city nate as i said was second wedgwood was third and the one recovered from a break win road gem to finish fourth five three two one unofficially here in race seven
Former three-year-old trotter of the year here in Summerside, Windermere, don't you worry, has rounded into fantastic form here as of late. Brody McPhee with a catch-driving call will take him into the winner's circle, the Woodmere Standard Bread's winner's circle. Windermere, don't you worry, trotting Chestnut Stallion 5 by Armbrough Barrister from the Revenue SM Gin Turtle Revenue. On by Eric Johnson of Summerside, trained by Norris Rogers, Brody McPhee, in the driver's seat, time for the mile at 159. Windermere, don't you worry. In the seventh. 